Something that you might find that you want to do is to periodically check in with your clients. So you can easily do that by creating a plan. And we actually don't need any variables for this. Click OK. And what you're going to do is ask scaled questions as a task. So let's say, um, you know, on a scale of one to 10, um, how confident are you that you can complete your workout? Oops, workouts next week, right? Then if we want to be able to track this task or this question, right, then we, we can add it to our task library. If you are not worried about being able to pull this question up again later or uh, aren't needing to track it in past performance, then you don't need to, right? And then what I would suggest doing is go in here and tell them what one to 10 is. Do not assume that they understand that one is, you know, no way in heck. And then 10 is be like, duh, that's easy, right? So tell them, you know, one being a chance and heck is are getting done, um, you know, and then 10 being easy peasy, right? And so you can go through and ask additional questions. Now, the reason that I've included a scale is because on the client end, they don't have a ton of space here. They have, I think, 46 characters, right? So by adding in a short answer option, option whoop, um, it makes it easier to make sure that we are, are not using up all of the space, right? Uh, Alternatively, just make sure that it is a, a question that they can answer, answer very briefly. Because once they finish this, uh, they can add in more details in the feedback section, either by typing where they have a lot more room to do it, or they can leave an audio note to elaborate. So you could, again, easily, you know, weekly check in, um, add in more questions, you know. Um, on a scale of one to 10, how much energy did you have this week? And then, you know, on average, how many hours, did, uh, how many hours of sleep did you get? So on and so forth, right? And so again, here's kind of what that, that would look like. And again, we're asking short answer questions. Uh, and then you can also even kind of warn them here, you know, uh, keep, the answer is short in the results box. You can elaborate in the feedback section, right? So this is just a really easy way to kind of add it into the line of things that need to be done and kind of getting a, a quick um, check in with them. And you can even ask, do you feel like you need a coaching call? Right? Yes or no, right? Because then if they say yes, then you know to reach out to book something, right? So uh, super easy to set up. And then obviously, uh, you know, publish to that client or add it to your program templates. So you can easily reuse this over and over again. And that's it. So that's how you get to check in with clients in QuickCoach.